Nine Molly said, too legit to quit. So hot. I want to touch the hiney. <laughs> want to reply? Read again. Too legit to quit. So hot. I want to touch the hiney. <laughs> games on here because then it wouldn't be safe for driving. He's like, don't worry about it, it's not that big of a deal. He's like, but there's an upgrade feature. I was like, you should have been like, I only want to buy the cars with the games in them. Show me the cars with the games. Show me the games. I'm happy to do that. What would you like it to say? Hey Heather, exclamation point. I updated your message. Oh, it okay. says, hey hey. <laughs> Welcome to the Bobblehead family, Heidi and Nick. Pound, clap, clap, ching, ching, fireball. <laughs> I love it. I like when Boston does this kind of stuff. It's just like, you know what? Let's just put the dirt right there. Yeah. But the it dirt, actually blocks the dirt. The dirt's been there so long, it's growing its own grass. <laughs> it's growing grass better than my yard. <laughs> hey, have you been to Boston recently? No, I actually haven't. Yeah. I haven't, haven't. Only this morning, last night, and every day prior. <laughs> Look at that shirt's awesome. Too bad you didn't wear your shirt that says tickles. You guys could hang out. No, I have one that says hugs. So, guy we're seeing right now, new client, referred by Derek Sawyer. Is that what you said? Yeah, Derek Sawyer, Washington Trust. Awesome. And he just bought a multi-million dollar condo in the Millennium Towers. His daughter will be living there. And he wanted to review the quote that we had sent him over. and. Sarah mentioned that we'd love to come and meet them, so. Every time I drive to Chinatown, I am hungry. I'm starving right now. Yeah, so, uh, Fortunately, we couldn't film up in the Millennium Towers, uh, but had a really good meeting with him, left with the answers he was looking for, and uh, got a new client, so. We are seeing Bill, and he is, he runs Next Step, which is a important charity for one of our referral partners, uh, Jason Highland. And Jason's gonna be there too. Oh, great. Which is great. Also, the Guinness a day will keep the doctor away. Is that what they said? It's a shirt. It's got to be true. You've seen that shirt before? Of course. Oh. Seen it. I own six copies of it. What colors? All the rainbow. You own the entire rainbow of Guinness? Keeps the doctor away? It's like Lucky Charms. <laughs> so Matt, what I think we should do, I think uh, here's an idea we should discuss. A new one? I, I really, I'm kind of sick of your conservative approach to our company. <laughs> I think, I think you just do you need me to be more flexible I, and liberal? It's Larry Rideout's birthday yesterday. Um... I give him a call, wish him happy birthday, and ask him if he would appreciate an ice cream truck. For his birthday? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if I asked him if he wanted an ice cream truck for his birthday. <laughs> I'm a little late to the... A little late to the scene, Larry. I'm gonna get you a truck. <laughs> I'll play that birthday music for you too. Do you sing Happy Birthday? No, no. Can I sing Happy Birthday? No, no, it's not. It's not a thing. I'm doing it. You do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Get your shit together. <laughs> Zach, I don't know if you got that parallel parking job, but that's the stuff people dream about at night. 
He's coming out to let us in. Oh. We're gonna have a vlog of you just trying to open doors. Uh, these guys. Jason, look at that jacket, though. Just Woo! Wait, wait, wait. Whoa, oh, stop. Geez. I didn't know we'd be like, hi. Hey, K9. Hey, nice hey, to meet buddy. you. Hey, I'm Matt. Hello. 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 Hey. Wow. So, a big, kind of a central part of our programming is really giving, uh, giving them their voice, helping them discover what their voice is. So, um, we use the arts a lot for that. Uh, this little piece was done by a young woman who, um, who was a participant in our program from the very beginning. She was Pat of the Stat, as we say here in Boston. Um, and she unfortunately succumbed to her illness uh, about six years ago now. And this was made in her honor. What we really help youth do is kind of organize the events of their life, put it in their own words, and then tell that story the way it's supposed to be told. A, wow. a lot of the quotes story. out there had a lot to do with control of your own destiny. You know, and creating that story, creating that line, you know, and, and taking ownership. Right. I think that's, that's powerful. Like, you feel like you're in control. How do you address the reality of the diagnosis with these guys while fostering optimism? You want to get it from sitting on your shoulders and weighing you down to sitting next to you. And yeah. being part of, yeah, I love it. part of who you are. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, like that. I, I was so impressed by the... I, I did my research, um, and I and I looked oh at a, a lot of what you guys are about. I love it. Like mm -hmm. there is this kind of passionate connection to your core values, mm -hmm. which I really appreciate about your organization. Like I, I don't you. know that I've ever seen it in an insurance company. We want to meet them where they are, help them shift their mindset, and then say, "Look at what's possible." You know, even if you're not going to be Beyonce you can still make a really cool song that's about you. Particularly because this is a new field. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's not just a new business, it's a new field. There, there wasn't anything um, that was for this transitioning group that are dealing with these serious illnesses. No, this, is, uh, this is important. I, I like it. It's a good perspective shift. I, I think our brand has been very small because the brand really is the story that we're telling and that's it. That's the only way we get it out. Yeah. But um, if you wouldn't mind, we'd love to help you with that problem. I mean, we can share some ideas. We can brainstorm. Thanks for coming. Yeah, thank you. Really Pleasure meeting you. It. Appreciate it. Pleasure meeting you. Yeah. So I, yeah. I haven't really listened too much just because I can't I, can't, I know, I know. I just want to keep... So I just, just want to keep looking inside. Oh, his own name! And that was like a really... Uh, breath of fresh air, I would say, for what kind of is going on and what other people are interested in. Mm -hmm. I, would, I would just say, really powerful guy, powerful message, and I'm just so thankful that Jason introduced us. We'll probably get changed, not necessarily on camera, depending on what we decide to do. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Yeah. I, that's, that's, that's what the plan was! Yeah, so right now we're on the way to play our first member guest at Framingham. Yep, Framingham Country Club. Zach and I have been members for uh, three or four years. Yep. Yeah. I feel like every time we golf, we, we're meeting somebody that we, we should really be in front of. Every single time we do something like this, we get a, a good amount of time in front of somebody who's going through the same struggles we are on the golf course, yeah. and they open up about business, and they, they're really very open to change. What are, what are you doing today? I'm doing black pants and gray Nike shirt. Okay. You're going to wear a shirt today? I'm going to wear a shirt today, yeah. It's too bad. Last time it was just like flat brim hat, bare, bare bottoms, bare chest. I went shorts. I went gray. So we're going to be gray gray. Did you go gray Rory McIlroy gray with a no collar? Yep. No. <laughs> okay. Are you going to wear your white glove or your pink glove? Uh... Uh, upstairs, uh, in, my, in my hand, I'm wearing a white glove. <laughs> I can wear my Patagonia red, white, and blue hat mm -hmm. that has Bubba Watson's signature on it. Mm -hmm. Or what I'll definitely do is wear my GNN hat. Swag on swag on swag on swag? Yep. Yeah, swag, triple swag. Do a triple swag, the double stamp. So I think Matt wins the wardrobe battle of Thursday. Hey, um, ba -dum -bum -ba -dum. so other topic was in the biz dev long term issues list. We have two. <laughs> <laughs> so 
sorry. Uh, I haven't eaten yet today. I haven't eaten yet today. I'm so hungry. I can't control my lips. You know, it's, so, it's so funny. Is when some people like aren't interested in the conversation, you can't really tell. When you're not interested, it's just like, farts out right now. What's the order? What do you want, sunshine? Grande, cold brew, two-shot red eye, coconut milk, unsweetened. Yeah, well, it sounds like you're going to order it then, because I will not remember all that. Coconut milk, unsweetened. You did a great job. Thank you. Oh, he did too. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> he said, you're welcome. I mean, you know that Dane Cook skit? <laughs> Whopper, no onions. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'll pay for it. Sure. You are. You're the man. You You're keep. Right? You just keep impressing us. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. You know, the secret of opening this. Hold on. Quickly. You lick your fingers. <laughs> so. I didn't pay for the drink, but I didn't get said drink. What the hell is this? Oh no. I didn't want to correct him because it's a free coffee no matter what it is. They have a great vibe, but the only way they get their great vibe is from the great people that work for them. How do they get great people to work for them? Because they put it out. This is what we want. I would love to. I bet you if I Google core value of the Starbucks, something comes up. Oh. What's up, brother? Hey, guys. How are you? Hello. How you Good. What's shaking? Uh, I'm mean, someone taking a picture of me here. Always. Why? Uh, why not, Jim? That's really weird. Yeah. I feel like taking a picture of my junk. <laughs> Low level. That's right there. <laughs> not it's not that type of film. What is this? So, got you guys some uh, some GNN swag. Oh, excellent. Oh, nice. Good man. Thank you very much. Yes. Thanks. <laughs> Do you have your mic on? I don't have my mic on. Oh, I don't have my mic on. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but yeah. Fun day ahead. Awesome. Appreciate you guys coming all out. Yeah. Here. Yeah, thanks, thanks for having us. Good time. Vlog. See you, vlog. Sound off. <laughs> <laughs>